to Moving Math and Science. In this video, we like to, I'd like to talk about finding the area of a quadrilateral. And a quadrilateral is a four-sided figure. Area is the number of square units needed to fill a two-dimensional shape. Area is labeled with square units. And an example is square meters, which is written as either square meters or meters square. This does not mean that you square the number. It is not an exponent. Okay. When calculating area, formulas are used to substitute the given numbers and solve for the missing value. The formula for each area of a polygram is area equals base times height. The height is determined by a perpendicular line drawn from the opposite side to the base. It forms a 90 degree angle with the base. A 90 degree angle might be shown with a dotted line or a square in the corner. The formula for a rectangle can be area, excuse me, area equals base times height or area equals length times width. Okay, so let's apply this to a couple problems. Okay, the first problem I'd like to solve is we have this quadrilateral. Okay, and so the reason I, I chose this one is uh, it will show you how the height is this dotted line not the 28 inches so what we need to do in order to solve this we have area equals base times height the base is 9 inches and the height remember must be a perpendicular line which is this line it has a dotted line or it may have a, something in the corner and that is 22 inches so it would be 9 times 22 and then if you take 9 times 22, um, that equals 198. And we need to label it properly. And it's in inches, so it would be inches squared. Okay, so there's the first one. Now the next quadrilateral, we have 16 inches and it's a square. And with these dashes here, I know that each side is congruent. So I can write a 16, each side is equal. So in order to get the uh, area, I can use 16 as the base. And the height, uh, I know that this is a 90 degree angle. And so I can use the 16 there. So it'll be 16 times 16, which is 256. And my unit of measure will be centimeters squared. Okay. Go and last and work one. this last one. And this is a word problem. Uh, it says a rhombus has an area of 714 yards. What is the height if the base unit is 42? Well, let's use the formula. Area equals base times height. And so let's see what is given. It is They have given us the area of 714 and a base of 42 yards. And we're trying to find height. So now I'm just solving a one-step equation. I'll draw a line down the middle. I have multiplication. So to undo multiplication, I use the inverse operation, which is division. So I will divide each side by 42. 42 divided by 42 will be 1. So that's going to cancel. So I have h is equal to 714 divided by 42. So now I just merely uh, divide these. 42 will go into 71 one times. So we have 42. Uh, this becomes a 9. Take 1 away. That becomes 29. So that's 294. And 42 times 7 is 294. So the height equals 17. And what is my unit of measure? It is yards. Okay. 
So that's kind of working backwards using the area formula to find a missing length. I hope that helps in finding area. Thanks for watching and Moving Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.